How many times have you lost a tool or misplaced one? Or maybe you've had a tool stolen. How many times have your crews lost productivity because they left an essential tool back at the shop? If you can relate to any of these scenarios, then Invisitag is the solution for you. Our system will give you a 100% accurate and automated checklist of all your tools and equipment for both when you go to the job site and when you return from the job site. And all of this information will be right at your fingertips. What is RFID? RFID is radio frequency identification. The best way to explain it is to compare it to barcoding. It's very similar, but it is 10 times better. With barcoding, you're only able to scan one item at a time. Also, barcoding is not as effective as RFID, simply because with barcoding, your labels can smear or they can be destroyed. With RFID, you are able to scan as many items as you'd like, all simultaneously. Also, this is what the RFID tag looks like. This tag, as you can see, is weatherproof, virtually indestructible, and its lifetime is and its lifetime is limitless. Now we're going to show you how easy it is to set up and utilize our app. There are basically three components to that. First component is you want to set up your tags. Primarily what you're doing there is assigning an RFID tag to each piece of equipment or tool. Secondly, you want to set up a group. And by group, um, you can categorize Say, say a certain job requires multiple hammers or shovels. You can group, you can have one group called shovels, one group called hammers. And then the final step would be setting up the job selection, the job category. And you can name that whatever job it is, whether it be an irrigation job, a lawn maintenance job, or whatever the case may be. All right, so now I'm gonna show you how to set up a tag. Very simple, you hit set up tag, and then you want to click Tag Assignment. And once this, the, the connection has been established, it will give you all of the available tags. You select your tag, and then you can name it whatever you want. For today, we're going we're gonna to label this hammer. So you type in the name. I'm going to call this Hammer 7, since this particular job requires a lot of hammers. And you click OK and the tag has been set up. And the reason why we set up tags first is so that we can create a database. That way we can manipulate that and insert any of those tags into a job or into a group. Okay, now we're gonna set up our groups. You just select set up group, and then select group assignment. And from here you wanna name your group. And we've already said this job requires multiple hammers. So we're gonna assign this group name as a hammer. Once we do that, your list of everything that contains the word hammer will pop, will pop up. And from there, you can just select the tags that you want to include in that group. Once you've selected all your items, you click OK, and you've set up your group. Alright, the final step is setting up the job itself. So you hit a set up job and then job assignment, and here you assign the name of your, of your job. For today, we'll use the word demo, since we're doing a demonstration today. Once you click OK after you name it, all of the tags in your database will pop up. From there, you select all of the items that you want to put into this job. Once you've done that, you click OK, and you've got your job set up. Right, now we're gonna show you how easy it is to run a job selection. We have already set up a job, which we call demo trailer. On this, on this job, we put three items. One was the two and a quarter inch wrench, the other was the shop vac, and the mower. So now we're going to run the app. All you do is hit begin, and you hit job selection, and then we're gonna select demo trailer, since that was the one we already set up. Okay, so next we hit the start button. And as you can see, once you hit the start button, you establish a connection between the mobile device and the unit. As the, as the device um, scans the trailer, it will detect all three items. And as it scans it, it will change them from red to green. And if everything is in green, you know you're good to go. Thank you so much for watching our video and our demonstration. Hopefully you've come away with a better understanding of Invisitank. 
One thing we'd like to leave you with is our mission. And our mission for you is to realize that by using Invisite, you can increase productivity, decrease labor cost, which gives you more money in your pocket. So thank you again so much for watching our demonstration. Please visit our website and certainly like us on Facebook. Have a great day.